<laughs> Yuck! Look at the look in her eye. She's ready to play in this sand. So I gotta walk all the way down to the gift shop in two million degree heat to get this puddle jumper that I know is not gonna fit Ren. However, everybody is insisting that we do it. It's not gonna fit her, she's not gonna like it, it's gonna be a disaster. Tara is addicted to shopping on Amazon, but I never thought it could get this bad. Hey buddy, you like camping so far? Are you having fun, man? It's one of our favorite places to camp. Welcome to SVT by Camping Edition. Yeah, we're roasting weenies and we're we probably going to make some s'mores later. I don't know. We're, we're going to see how we feel about the s'mores. Yeah. You didn't heat these up for me. Look at me. Well, Are you kidding me? Babe, I didn't know you. You just said save them. I said, I said turn up the She's grill. talking about these sweet potato things. I didn't want to burn them. Just it's one, good, girl. Just one. You always got a complaint, don't you? All right, y'all. This is how you get the perfect weenie over the roasted fire. All right. Yep. Yep. You gotta get the better cheddar, and yep. you yep. gotta let it blister until you see that cheese kind of gooing out. You know. And you gotta load it up with a little ketchup and a little mustard. And if you live in Florida, you gotta get the nature's own hot dog bun. It yep. is the yep. best. Yep. 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 Hey, That's hey, hey! Do don't lie to them. That ain't nature's own. That is nature's own. Oh, oh juice! <laughs> Tripping over the fire. This oh. is oh, Mrs. Fun. Fresher leaves. Well, you gotta get some fresher leaves because this is a good bun. <laughs> is it a good bun? <laughs> I think nobody's heard of fresher leaves before. Let us know in the comments is fresher leaves popular around where you are? Weird dog. <laughs> what, what you got? You got a weird dog. You got a weird dog? Yeah, that thing's a little crooked. It's a crooked dog. My dog is on here. I'm making a pizza dog. I'm hoping that comes out good. It's looking a little rough right now. Looking a little rough. I got the boar's head pepperoni that I'm throwing on it and then the, some mozzarella cheese. It's gonna be so good. And we can talk with a southern draw because we are in the south. And Tara is from southern Louisiana and she actually does have a real dialect. I've really do a southern accent before. Does it sound good? I don't like it. You don't like the way I talk? I like it. You're normal better. Also, it's 16 years that we've been married this week, guys. So everybody hit your thumbs up and give us a happy anniversary comment. That would be so nice of you guys. 16 years. We've been together married. And guess what? Oh, wait, wait, guys, guys. <laughs> I've been alive for 15 years. There's a bug. There's a bug. There's a bug going under there. Oh. Under the fire. It's oh. okay. What did I you say, Ada? Kill it. Kill it. Kill it, Dad. Kill it. What? Ew. No, just let it go. Let it, it live. Mama, you got the shoes. Too, it's please. a fire bug. It's give a fire bug. It wants to live. Please give me the uh -uh. shoes. These are my nice shoes. Give me my ones. shoes. Mm -mm. Michelle Bob. Oh, those are mom. Those He's are crawling away. Look at He's leaving. No, I don't like it, Dad. Please kill He's it. He's leaving. Look at him. He's going bye bye. My dog. Rory, don't Follow touch it with your hot dog. Here, I'm gonna I'm gonna push him out. There you go. He's gone. Tara put this thing up to 415 degrees so that she could warm up her sweet little potato tots. And I'm hoping that my bun is not burning, but it's smelling a little fried. 
So usually on my bun, I put um, mozzarella. Mozzarella on your bun? Yeah, because this is a, well. Let me see the bottom. Let me see the bottom. Let's just my, see. My pizza dog. All right, that ain't bad. That ain't bad. I can live with that. No color. Mm. Yeah, and it's Let's nice and warm. Down. So this is a campfire wiener <laughs> with pepperonis and uh, mozzarella cheese on it. So basically, let me show you guys. I'm gonna go get something at the pantry. What? I'm gonna show Shh, you guys. The baby something. is sleeping. You're so loud. Sorry. Why are you walking around with your dog on your shoulder? Walking around? Just like, can you just eat it all? She's got a dog on her shoulder. What get it? Instead of a chip on her shoulder. Yeah, I, I get it. That. So what we have here is the Rayo's homemade marinara. Jesse loves doing commercials. We're just going to put that For in there. Free. Get your dog out of my Rayo's. <laughs> Shh, the baby's sleeping. Wait, her bedroom is right there. Sorry. This is going on for way too right, long. Can you speed it up? Okay. We're gonna dip this here pizza Taste dog test. in the marinara. This here pizza dog. You know you gotta give me a bite. Mmm, 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 mmm. You, you don't, don't share? even know. <laughs> you can't create like a whole brand new thing and then not share. Try it. It's really good. Jeez, that was a giant bite. Hey, it's yo. so gritty. It's not that good, guys. Uh -huh. I forgot what those white things are that you roast over the fire. What are they called? Marshmallows? No, say it how you really say it. How does he say it? A marshmallow? <laughs> He's like, you know, you want the marshmallow? Marshmallow? That is so white grandpa mayonnaise. <laughs> like, that's just so white grandpa mayonnaise. Marshmallow! It looks like white grandpa mayonnaise. So it's the one that looks like the grandma from the fruits. What does that even mean? <laughs> Come on. Come on, girl. It's time for bed. Go sleep out here by yourself. Mm. Do you want daddy to carry you in? Alright. Can't forget Soros. <laughs> She's very specific about how she wants to be carried. Good morning! Good morning! Good morning! Good morning! What are we doing today? We're eating yogurt today? The whole day. The whole day? My gosh, that's a lot of yogurt to eat. Is that just what you're craving today? You want nothing else but yogurt. So Rory does this where she goes through phases about food that she likes. And I guess right now it's yogurt. So she's going to be eating yogurt. And... That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing today. But they actually have really good food at this place. But yesterday they were like really busy. So what I ended up saying was like, I went up there to the cash register and the girl was like, I just want to let you know it's going to be like an hour long wait because we're really busy. And I could tell that she was just like feeling overwhelmed. So I was like, no, I'll just come back later. Like I got food at the RV. I'll eat there. And like, we made the best tacos. So it worked we, out. Yeah, we ended up My making. My mom brought fresh shrimp over and we literally had shrimp and steak tacos while we were camping. Yeah. And gumbo, remember? And she brought gumbo. And she brought over, gumbo. So we yeah. We're actually going to give you guys a fridge tour. On last vlog, we were talking about the TV situation because the girls already had like three TVs set up. By the way, Scarlett didn't get to come. She had to get ready for school and stuff. Uh, so she was not allowed to come. Well, our kids don't go to school, so we don't so, do that. Um, but, anyways, let me show you guys the setup. Time out. What is Tara's that? Tara's got a skin flap. I'm shedding like a freaking lizard. Wait, let's see it. Does it hurt? I know. It's so weird. I just noticed. I'm like, what is that on my finger? Wait, let me get a good look at it. Hold on. I just on. peeled me... it off. It's right oh, here Oh, it's now. off now? Let me see it on here. It's right here. <laughs> Yuck! I'm like a lizard. Grab the brush. By the way, it's Tara and I's 16th year anniversary Woo! today, so... <laughs> Give us the love, you guys. Congratulations for that. Don't put yogurt in my mouth. Like a hey, 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 hey. So here's the setup. Uh, we've got two TVs up here. Looking pretty sick. Rory's got an iPad, you know. We were telling her that this trip, like, hey, you have to settle down with the device because she'll be on it all day. Literally all day. So, you know, she came swimming with us yesterday for a little while, but after, she's just so lazy. Like five hours. Yeah, after like out. five hours. And, and she's yeah. still listening and to it. I don't. Was leaving and I had to go stay with her longer. The amount of YouTube shorts this kid watches. 
And you know what? I bet you she doesn't even yeah. remember what she saw five shorts ago. Five shorts ago, Rory. What'd you see? I saw Roblox and it was like with a bunch of noobs. She and then I saw the scroll doing this other girl. Now scroll hair. five up and, and see if it's like, true. All right, all right, let's scroll but five up, see if it's, it's true. Not gonna oh, work she refreshed her page. She refreshed her page, guys. We're going to go show them the beach setup. Yeah, we're going to show you guys the beach we're setup. We're going to go finish setting that up real quick. Yesterday was like, we didn't vlog much because we just kind of wanted to chill. Oh, and it was busy. Um, it was like a jungle out there. It was there. really busy. Woo. And we just wanted to show you guys kind of like a low-key what we do for, you know, most days. Uh, anyways, the refrigerator setup, man, I want to show them. Well, I got to Can you guys this. move? We're done. All right, so I'm going to show you guys what we got in here. We have got a big thing of, I can't believe it's not butter. Because, I mean, it's not as healthy as real butter, but it's less calories. it is less calories. So, you know, I mean, I prefer real no, butter, but this stuff ain't bad. butter is so bad. It like tastes like butt. No, it doesn't. The good, oh my gosh, you guys got to get the Kerrygold butter. The Irish. The, oh, yeah, the Irish butter. It, like, Look at the stick. Irish. Look at the Irish. Irish. And their butter. <laughs> um, anyways, this is our gumbo that Grammy made us. And then we got the double stack eggs. Double stack eggs. Because Rennie is an egg eater. Um, food. Food. Of course, we got the boar's head sandwich meat. Because you're crazy if you don't have a boar's head. Now let me show you the most processed thing we contain in our freezer, okay? We got a Hungry Man meal, all right? That's it, all right. That's for emergency use. I don't know if you guys remember our vlogs from like, when we basically first started when Rory was Ren's age, but look, it's so cute. We haven't had these in so long. It's the Pirate Booty Puffs. Rory used to eat these like all the time, and now Ren, it's her new favorite snack. So it's just so cute. We got the big mama floaty guys. Wait till you see her all set up. On the run from my given disaster. Speed away from the holy mind. Pride. That's where I never. And here we have Baby Wren's Beach Palace. Let me show you the inside. We got some comfy towels, her sand toys, uh, life jackets for safety, and a ceiling fan. What? The wrecking ball is here. She's here. And she's here to wreck things. Look at her. Look at the look in her eye. She's ready to play in this sand. She loves this so much. So I just got back from ordering Ada food. She wanted me to surprise her. And I also got her a drink. We're gonna see if she likes the food and drink. Her food is still coming. But uh, we'll see if she likes the drink option I got her. Ada, I got you your drink. You know what it is? Huh? It's a sweet tea. Oh, looks like Rory wants it. So she didn't go crazy for the drink, but that's okay. I mean, what did I expect? Look at this girl. She's being crazy. Good job. She is literally being crazy. Yeah, she did. She will not settle down. She's been throwing herself in the water. Yes. She thinks it's hilarious. Are you drunk? Me and Ren are getting the passenger princess treatment here on the River Run Ultimate Floaty. Um, we got our cooler loaded up with pickles and drinks, and that's all we need. So we're gonna go have some fun. Uh, there's Rory, flopping like a fish. Okay, careful. You're drowning yourself. Baby. Oh my goodness. <laughs> there's Ada. Say hi, Ada. Hi. Ren, say hi. Oh, she's trying to escape. That's all she wants to do is escape. Right, yeah. Mommy. So Rand is definitely not cooperating with any of the relaxation tools that I brought. Um, babies don't relax. So what we're going to do is we're going to try to put her little butt into a puddle jumper because of the fact that she's trying to dive face first into the water. Um, she doesn't quite have the experience yet for that. So we're going to try to work, see if that'll work. Puddle jumper, let's go. Behind the scenes with no golf carts, bicycles, or scooters are allowed. We're going because we're humans, so we can go. Um, just kidding. I'm being dramatic for no reason. On copyright music. Hold on. One of Rory's favorite activities is finding clay in this man-made swimming pond. So we're gonna go and find some clay. I got her a bucket, and we're gonna see if we can find any. Now I gotta find her. I lost her. Oh, there she is. What I love about this place is that there's not too many rules, and the lifeguards are really relaxed. They're not breathing down your neck and power tripping. You just get to have a good, safe, fun time. Did you find your clay spot? Yeah, it's over here. 
All right, I'll hold the bucket, you get the clay. Ugh. The local poolside floaty shack did not have the puddle jumper. She said she sold out yesterday. So I gotta walk all the way down to the gift shop in two million degree heat to get this puddle jumper that I know is not gonna fit Ren. However, everybody is insisting that we do it. It's not gonna fit her, she's not gonna like it. It's gonna be a disaster. It's gonna be, it's gonna be a big fail. And I'm gonna get to tell everybody, I was right, you were wrong. And that's the only reason I'm doing this, for that satisfaction. The only reason I'm doing it. This is our bucket load so far. Trying to get this thing filled to the brim, baby. By the way, it's not the greatest sand for trying to make castles. It's been too rainy, so like the sand just stays so wet. The clay reminds me of like poop, you know, like poop water. I got it. Get all the sand. Rory will do this in the St. John's River. She'll go deep down into the river, and you definitely know there's gators, stingrays, and bull sharks, and the water looks just like this, if not even darker. Creeps me out, but she does it. All right, they have it here. Let's see what the weight limit on it is. Starts at 33 pounds, and I think runs only about 25, maybe 28. These bags are actually kind of cute. Oh, I might have to get her the mermaid one. She loves mermaids. But this one is so cute too. It's a little octopus, I think. We'll stick with this one. But this one fits 30 pounds. This one says 33. All right. I think I'm gonna have to go with the third. But why does it look bigger? Like that one looks bigger. Maybe not. I don't know. Oh, I got a good, I got a nice spot right here. Look at that clay, dude. That is like full clay. So I went with the mermaid one. Um, I don't know, it looks like it's actually bigger than the other one, but this one says it starts at 30 pounds and I think she's about 28. So I think this one should fit her better, but I still think it's gonna be a big fat fail. That's what I think. I'm not happy about it. I wish she would wear the dang puddle jumper. Although I know some teachers say, you know, don't let your kids rely on puddle jumpers, which I'm not. We are, she just keeps flinging herself in the water. And so I just need something just for now, just for temporary. But we do have our pool at home, which she never uses a floaty and we just let her like, you know, try to swim in that. But she's just not super interested in swimming yet. And uh, I'm not gonna push it because I've tried like taking to her into the pool for little swimming lessons and things like that. She just doesn't wanna get in. So she just wants to get in when she wants to get in. And then she just wants to be in the shallow water and fling her face into the water. That's what we're doing right now. That's what we're doing today. Man, you guys are heavy. I noticed we've been getting a lot of new people here. And that's why I gotta switch arms. Sorry, I'll never do that again. Um, <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm laughing at my own self. Okay, we're almost back there. We're going through the copyright music zone. I gotta stop and grab Ada's food first. Just remembered that. That was very good of me because I was just about to walk straight back without her food. I got the bag, guys. I got the bag. And Ada, was. she just said surprise her. So dad surprised her. So we're gonna all be surprised together. All right, what do we have? A salad and that looks like a burrito. ooh, like a wrap. A, ooh, like a southwestern wrap Let's with see. beans. How do you do? Really good. He did good. Yeah. I think it tastes better when somebody does this. This it is does. what I want done for me for, from now on, babe. That's what you want? Yeah, for our anniversary, I want you to pick out my anniversary dinner tonight. All right, you I gotta know. surprise me. Right, if you guys didn't know, Ren's into trucks. She got the tow mater from Cars. That's so cool, Ren. And then here's our little meal. She got some chicken. She got a little piece of corn. On today's episode of Smelly Belly TV Spa, we have found a true hidden gem. A natural clay mud bath. It's great for the skin. You can rub it on your body, you let it dry, and then you just jump into the freshwater pond that we also discovered. So this campground comes equipped with your very own clay mud bath. Look at this. It's you amazing. With it, you gotta do a little searching. You gotta do a little well, searching. Put my foot in there and see how nice it is. <laughs> Ew, they're putting that on their body. Oh. Don't put your foot. I'm not putting yeah. it on my body. Oh, that's so just like diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> you don't think your babies are paying attention. They are paying attention. Look at Rennie. She's walking around talking to a camera. She's talking to the camera and she's thinking she's like actually vlogging. She even checks the record button and she's like, Yes, I'm recording. And then she continues on with her business. It is the cutest thing ever. And I think we got some footage of her. Yeah. So but just I buckle was, up, it might be a little shaky. I was recording her and then 
she took over. <laughs> but I think she really thinks she's vlogging something. What are you yeah. saying? What do you have to say? Are you showing them the water? Oh, so nice. <laughs> Okay, so this is actually kind of crazy to me watching back the footage. I had just given Ren the camera right about here and told her that it was recording. And <laughs> this is hilarious. Look at this. She gets a nice steady shot of what's in front of her. Looks like she's trying to get a good shot on her little juice cup. And then she's trying to get a shot of Grammy here. But look at that steady hand. She's a natural vlogger. It's crazy. I've told you guys in the past that Tara is addicted to shopping on Amazon, but I never thought it could get this bad. She somehow had an Amazon package arrive to the RV site. I don't even know what's in there. We're getting some home and then we went like, to the trip and it Rory, me. I have no idea. I have no idea how she got an Amazon package. This is your mom we're talking about. She's an Amazon junkie. Should we open it up? I think we're gonna open it up. Well, I'm gonna have Tara open it up and we'll film it. We'll see what she's ordering to the RV. Hello guys, so right now, I'm going to drop off my dad's swimsuit because he's at the gym right now and he's gonna go swimming after. So I'm dropping off his swimsuit and then I'm going to the store. Like, oh, that's like on like this little area. I'm going to the store and I'm gonna buy some shampoo and conditioner because we're like almost out of conditioner and this hair is crusty. She needs some little loving, so. Yeah, that's what's happening. We are delivering the swimsuit to the gym. Oh, it was heavy. Hello, sir. Oh. Here you go. Thank you, thank you. You're welcome. You have anything to say? Um, may the force be with you today. I have no idea where we're at in the vlog or what we vlogged last, but here's what's going on. It's about 8 o'clock at night now, and uh, Ren is laying down watching a movie, Ada Bear's with her, and Rory's still in the top bunk of the RV. You guys have probably hardly even seen Rory on this vlog. The kid has just become a want to stay in bed, lay all day kind of person, so <laughs> that's just where she's at in life right now. We still gotta open up and find out what is in Tara's Amazon package. Oh, that's right. Because, um, don't know what that's all about. But what we're gonna do, what we're about to do is Tara and I are gonna go and get all of our beach supplies back. We gotta bring them back from the beach back to here. And then we're gonna go to the arcade and try to win Rory some stuffies because she hasn't been feeling like getting out. So we're just gonna win her stuffies for her. And then, we might have to make like a chocolate run, something like that. I, I'm not sure. We're going to the arcade. Yes. Why? First we gotta go drop off all our stuff. <sighs> really? Yeah. Rory needs more stuffies. Not really, no. Uh. We found the Mario machine! And I see two good prospects so far. We have a Mario and we have a King Kong. And we got five bucks and that's all we're spending. That puts the pressure. Okay. That's it. I really want to get a Princess Peach, but she's a little too tucked in. I feel kind of sad about that, but that's okay. How many? Okay. How many of these do I put in? Four? I think so. I think it's a dollar. Yeah. Thank you. 
It said thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. You're She's welcome. so nice about it. You're welcome. There is a King Koopa right here. Oh God, we're, oh. we're going straight for the King Koopa. I, that's that's Yoshi, baby. Is that Yoshi? Oh, it looked like a King Koopa at first. Oh. It wasn't meant to be. One dollar down, four more to go. All right, I'm a winner. You going for Yoshi? Uh, I didn't really decide. But yeah, Yoshi's probably the best bet. Uh, he's got to get a Yoshi. I'm going to be so disappointed if we leave without him. Come on, Yoshi! It's rigged. It's official. It's rigged. We're that going, one? I think he's a knockoff Mario. Look at his nose. No, nah, he's the real deal. No, he looks pretty knockoff to me. Come on, Mario. Mm, gotta get him by the big head. Bro, that thing wasn't even trying to it's grab It's not him. even gripping at all. I think we just lost five bucks. I have to give it Yoshi. We're down. We're down to two dollars left. Hey, try letting go a little early too. What does that mean? Like press the button and then like let it go right when it hits. Yeah, right there. I don't think it matters when you let it go. I don't know. It, mine seemed to drop pretty far. Okay, we've moved on to this cool machine. This actually looks like there's funner stuff. Get, babe, get that little stress ball in that little egg. You see that? Yeah, I yeah, see it. Yeah, a little yep. squishy. Yeah, that's the one we want. Is that good? Uh, it looks lined up to me. Maybe to the left a little. Oh, oh no, shoot. that's good. That's good. <gasps> oh. Wait, yeah. how, how do you have only one quarter left? Did they give us an extra quarter? That doesn't How's make that? sense. Everything was a dollar. All right, hold on. Oh, he thinks he's gonna win it right now. Let's see if he has the skills to pay the bills, baby. Let's go drop it. Oh, you was way off. Boy. Oh, but boy. We got some good separation. We got some good separation. <laughs> it's, all all, right. it's all about the strategy. Okay, we said we were going in with five no. bucks only, and we spent 15 bucks. So, what does that tell you? And Tara's been a fish today. She's back in the pool. And she's making me want to go in now. So nice. No, let's go back and get my swimsuit. Can we, can we go back and get my suit? What if we go back, the kids will see us and we'll be able to leave because they'll need things. No, they won't. Yeah, they will. They're sleeping. No, they're not. Are they? Yes. Plus the pool closed at dark. It only have like five minutes till dark. You should have just been prepared to seize the moment. Like me. Well, I didn't. <laughs> okay, I'm running back. I'm gonna go get my swimsuit. I'm gonna go check on the kids first, make sure they're okay. I left Tara. And I'm going swimming. I wanna get in the water. Tara can't be the only one having fun around here. Alright, so I went to go get my swimsuit on and look who's with me. Rory, she's finally up in the night. Well, she's been up all day, but you know what I mean. She's finally getting out of the house. I think the sun, she just doesn't like it. You you just don't like the sun, do you, hon? It's just too hot for her. All right, so Tara does not know that Rory's with me. So Rory wanted to try to scare her. We'll see if it works. All right, so no, we found her. To me. Oh, she saw you. Oh, she knew it was you. All right. We were supposed to be getting cool shots, but this is what we're getting instead. All right, we're all going under. I'm gonna get doinked in the head with the GoPro. We're supposed to swim together under the water like a plane. I think this is the most awkward family thing we've ever filmed. Uh, we're doing a, a train. An underwater train. An underwater train. Here we go. Grab onto my leg. She got tricks, tricks. Let's see them. Woo, girl, that was a good round off. Okay. Oh goodness. Oh, she's gonna fly. 
This one, she's been out in the sun all day. Oh, crispy. Her a face, bacon. <laughs> red. And you know, no, I reapplied. Okay, my tip of the day was to reapply. Yeah, so maybe you're just hot, not sunburned. I'm hot. It's time for the moment you all have been waiting for. What is in this Amazon package? <laughs> all right, so this is how a beast opens Amazon packages. You just, just rip it on you know, open. The Amazon tape is usually pretty weak. Yeah. They did some extra to this one. They did. They did. They really, really but secured not... this. Okay. So I know this seems silly, but it actually makes sense. And we've been waiting for this this entire trip. And we get it the day before we leave. But the vent covers to cover our little lights up in the ceiling. Mm. It makes... He's not happy. So now we can sleep in? <sighs> not just that. It helps keep it cool or warm, whatever. It's insulation. Oh, it's insulation. It's insulation. Yeah. I mean, if you guys don't know, these RVs do not hold no, air, air, air temperature very well. Thin and over the door organizer. You can't Ooh. really see what this is, but you put it over the door and you can hold like all your crap. All you the know? crap, yeah. You got a lot of crap when you go camping. I'm still confused. Oh, on oh, the door. Wait. Okay, yeah. What's I this? wasn't listening. She doesn't even know what she ordered, guys. Shower caddy for the shower? I thought I deleted that from my cart. Oh, I guess you didn't. We now have a shower caddy that I didn't want. <laughs> uh, does anybody then, else's wives do this? Oh, I did Ooh. want this. I did want what this. What is that? It's like the little ice tray where you put the ice cubes on top and you go, and then the ice crushes down at the bottom. You wouldn't know what it is, but they know. They know what do I'm talking about. Do you guys know what she's talking about? Yes, they do. It comes with a little bucket. Yeah, this is good. I hope you guys had a great time on the RV trip with us. Did. And uh, we have some fans that are gonna say, "Eat your pickles." Yes, they tonight. are. Here's the shout so outs, excited. and we'll see you guys in the next one. So we met some smelly bellians here while we were on vacation, and uh, they're gonna help us end the video right now. Yes, they are. Good are you ready, guys? Eat your pickles, kids. Stuck in the middle.